I might be misquoting, but I think, I think Matt Damon said at one point that you stop emotionally maturing at the age you get famous. Do you agree with that? <laughs> Matt did, you're right. Uh, Matt did. <laughs> 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 That'll get back. <laughs> but is there any is there any truth to that? That that once once the trappings of fame sort of surround you, um, your your emotional development sort of stunts in a way. Well, if, I mean, if you if you do, I mean, it's that'd be your own fault. Yeah, yeah I would think. But I think you, your your ex, your daily life experience would change, and therefore there are certain things that you don't. You know, actors. My favorite thing used to be to just sit in the subway and watch people. Mm -hmm. and just walk by myself everywhere and just live among people and watch them and talk to strangers and be and I lost that that's yeah. the hardest yeah. thing and it was the lose. hardest thing to lose and and I think that does affect you mm -hmm. you 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 learn quickly how to how to get to know people how to build kind of a maybe smaller world but intimate world and and grow and learn from people and still do the same but it's different Mm -hmm. You also have to yeah. judge people based on a different set of rules because yeah. everybody will give you their best game when you meet them, you yeah. know, because they're, they want to hire you for something or because you could green light their film. Or, you know, so there's always sort of this, you know, I have the waiter test, which is, you know, you go out with a producer who says, I'm a great guy, everybody loves me. Yeah. And you see how they treat a waiter, you know, because, you know, like, I'm a fantastic guy. Hey, I didn't order that. And you're like, oh, <laughs> oh hey, maybe you're not such a great guy, you know. <laughs> it's a good... Method. But you're right. It, it, it's actually you are sort of covered. It's trickier. You know, it's harder to get back to like. You know, you can't go to a ball game and just go to a ball game. Right. Ellen, how are you finding it? It's yeah, she's in the new run. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, this is. I would never, you know, consider myself obviously to. I don't know. It's it's obviously new and it's kind of intense right now and a little mm. surreal. Obviously, I'm just sitting at this table. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, I'm, it's, I've been so absorbed in it that I don't even really have the, the outside perspective right now. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Mm. And you said something really the other night at the Critics' Choice Awards, and you said that it gets to a point sometimes when you start being unable to recognize mm. yourself, and there are those moments, mm. uh, or even just moments within the moments of being like, what? You know? <laughs> But uh, it is what it is, and I, you know, I don't know what's going to happen, and mm. we'll see. Were, you, were both your parents were actors? Are actors? Yes. And are they famous in? in uh, no, no, no. They're um, um, act, actors on stage, mm -hmm. um, but they're not famous like um, a movie uh, actor. Uh, so you didn't grow up around it, or? Uh, no, no. But um, it's. I think it's something. You, you never get used to it. It's something strange to, yeah, to be recognized, to be, as you said, that you can't live normally with uh, people because they know, they think they know something of you. And, um, but me, it's, it's very different because France is, is not like, uh, uh, the, the light on the, the American uh, actors are very bright in, in France. It's kind of different. Yeah. But while well, I live in France uh, since the movie came out, is very different. My life has changed. Mm -hmm. And um, as you, like you said, it's, um, it's something... Uh, I mean, we're telling people stories as an actor. You're... Um, you have to be close to reality and uh, to people. So you really have to find the right balance and to handle, uh, to be still close to people, but protect yourself in a way and, uh, and still be there to tell their stories. So. It must have been an extra pressure in France playing Pia. I mean, well, really yes. no, I mean, that's like, you know, if you're in England but, playing... But, on the other end, you're so happy that the movie is a big success and that all those people are um, there to see the movie. Um, but w since the, the movie came out in France, I've, I've traveled a lot. Yeah. And each time I, I go back to France, it's so weird that I really don't have the same life anymore. Mm -hmm. Can't take the subway anymore. Mm -hmm. 
and uh, and I like to take the subway because it's it, there's so yeah. many people, yeah. so many characters. But if you're starting to look at all those people, it's you can't. I can't do that anymore. It's quite new. I mean, if I'm starting looking and I I yeah. put my energy outside, I mean, I don't know exactly how to express this, but I can't look at people. Uh, as I was able to right. do it before. To study them, yeah. So, yeah. but as but you said, you it's like this. Here you could ride the subway. So. I mean, no one, no one, rec you're unrecognizable <laughs> as Pia. Here everyone knows oh, you're yes. just as Pia, and you look there's nothing no like Pia. There's no subway here, what are you kidding? <laughs> and there's no subway. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, I, I, I think we all sort of do agree that, you know, this is us talking about a difficulty or a part of one thing that's complex in, in dealing with fame. But sometimes in front of an audience, that can come off as a bunch of people who are doing very well whining about how good their li life is. And so I, you know, I, 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 I don't find that to be the case with the people that I meet and work with. They're, you don't find them miserable because of all of this stuff. It is just a subject of this issue, you know, of yeah. saying, is it complete, it's not that easy to, to always make contact, you know. But not necessarily. I'm whining sometimes. <laughs>